I've got nothing to do with Ford, okay? As a matter of fact, I don't think Ford cares if, if I exist, quite honestly. I don't think they care if I drive their cars or not. But I had a Ford Raptor. I love the Ford Raptor. It is literally my favorite truck. It, I'm up on top of this mountain because I think that this truck is the king of the mountain. I think it is the best truck that there is. I just want to explain why I'm getting a new truck. Nobody seems to understand. They all think I'm nuts. And you know what? I am. Oh, I understand. You're addicted. So I had a 2013 Raptor, and I loved it. Uh, I did a ton of work to it. I took it to the SEMA show in 2013. It was at the Magnaflow booth. I had a truck top camper built for it. Went camping in it went from Colorado to California with Jude in it. It was awesome. And then I got it climbing up to about 100,000 miles and I thought it's still retaining its value even though it has a lot of miles. If I keep going, it's not gonna retain its value if I'm gonna unload it. I better do it now. I made kind of a mistake. I bought a GMC Denali pickup truck. Now it's not really truly a mistake because it's actually a really awesome truck. Honestly, it is. I mean, it is the Cadillac of trucks. There's no question about it. Why the hell would I get rid of it and get another Raptor? I miss my Raptor and I want a new Raptor. I'm going to take it in the ass, selling it a little bit, this truck. I just miss my Raptor because I look at this truck and I go, wow, that is a beautiful truck. But I don't look at this truck and go, that's a badass truck and I look at the Raptor and I go that's a badass truck. The other part of it is the whole other side of it. I love off-road vehicles. I'm like a country boy these days. I like to be able to just drive over anything. So I decided I'm gonna look around for a Ford Raptor. They've been out for a little while now the new ones. Well Everybody wants five, ten, fifteen, twenty thousand dollars over MSRP. It's a production truck. It's a bitchin' production truck, but it's a production vehicle. So why would they be over MSRP? And it's only because of the demand. I just don't want to pay over MSRP for a truck. I think it's for anything like that unless it is really a special edition vehicle and I don't even know if I would do it then but I couldn't find one in the state of California. Um, I think it's wrong that Ford allows their dealers to do that. I mean we could argue this point forever and I'm not gonna leave comments on the vlog about it because I'm sure there's gonna be dealers saying hey I should be able to charge what I want for a car but just for me I'm not gonna pay it okay that's all there is to it. Celeste Peck is a friend on Facebook she's a Poison fan uh, her and her boyfriend found one at the dealership that he's a mechanic at and the owner said I'll sell it to him for MSRP. Now the only thing I have to do is ship it, which from Illinois it's, it's not around the corner. It's a 32 hour drive. I could ship it five to ten times compared to what I saved not paying over MSRP. So it was worth it to me. The only thing I don't like is I have to wait for it. It finally has arrived and we are on the way to pick it up right now. So this is a pretty big deal. I have this car broker, his name is Louis Bookout. He helped me put the deal together. So we're gonna go get this. Man, the sky is really dark. Look at this. It's gonna, it's My gonna... brand new clean Raptor that I'm about to get is going to be all dirty. I see my truck from here. Do you see the top, the red oh, roof? I see the top of it right now. <laughs> oh, there it is, looking all pretty. It's already got a Louis book out tag on it. Oh, it already has a Louis book out tag. Oh, on it. yeah. He's right there watching you smoking his cigar. There he is. Said truck. Why don't you pull into this joint and you can get out and get first hand view of it? 
<laughs> wow! It's pretty, isn't it? Yeah. This is Louis Bookout. <laughs> Not that I wasn't going to put his name underneath here. But it's kind of crazy how that works. Yep. I've only had the truck a few days. Uh, I think all the colors are nice, um, but I, I just really love this ruby red. As far as like, it kind of is like my hot rod. It's kind of my off-road car. It's kind of my everyday car. It kind of does everything for me that I need it to do. Thank <laughs> you.